What is a special session? Every two years, the Texas legislature, made up of the House and the Senate, meets for 140 days to file, consider, and pass legislation. This period is called the regular session. Thousands upon thousands of bills are filed on hundreds of different subjects. Of course, with only about five months to work with, not every bill gets debated, much less receives a vote or makes it into law. Oftentimes, critical legislation can get deadlocked and more time is needed to find a solution. When that happens, the Texas Constitution empowers the governor and only the governor to call the legislature back to the Capitol for a special session. He can do it at any time, but typically they happen during the summer, right after the regular session has ended. Special sessions have a maximum length of 30 days. If the legislature has not completed its work, the governor can keep calling special sessions until he's satisfied with the outcome. But the most important difference between a regular and a special session is that the governor has the sole authority over what issues can be considered. He will publicly declare this in what is referred to as the call of the session. While he can't dictate specific language of any bill draft, he can set narrow parameters to ensure the legislature is fully focused on a particular subject. For example, if the governor calls the legislature back to pass a bill to secure the border, the legislature cannot take that opportunity to increase education funding, cut property taxes, reform health care, and so on. The legislature must stick to only what is on the call. Further, the governor can also veto any legislation sent to him, giving him additional influence. Issues can be handled in a few days, a few weeks, or even require multiple special sessions to be called by the governor. This process ensures that the legislature has the opportunity to resolve even the most contentious issues and serve the people of Texas.